Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Eileen, and today I'm going to show you a new release from Beltress Bonavita in Cream Soda Blonde and Root Beer Float Blonde. I have it in two colors. I am wearing my Alpha Blend in Cream Soda Blonde, so I wanted to make sure you got to see that. I've already, re already reviewed this one. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Please like and subscribe. I upload a couple times a week. Also have lots of things happening over on Instagram at Crazy Wig Lady. Both of these styles I purchased with my own funds from wigstudio1.com. So be sure to go over there and check it out. Okay, let's have a look at Bonavita. Okay, let's talk about Bonavita now. Both of these styles, both of these colors, I have just taken out of the box. They still have the tags attached. I have not tried them on. They still have the zigzag part. I wanted to try them on with you. So I just put them on mannequin heads so we could, first of all, talk about the colors. That's what I wanted to do first. Now, Cream Soda Blonde, I'm wearing it. This is also it. So this is a beautiful blended shade, ashy fibers, lots of blondes going through here. It also has a little bit of satin blonde, I think. Just a beautiful, beautiful color. Lots of dimension here. It is not rooted, as you see. So this is cream soda blonde. And again, that is what I'm wearing in Alpha Blend. Now, this is a beautiful color as well, Root Beer Float Blonde. I've reviewed this before, but I really want you to have a look at it. It's a light pearl shade, and it has a lot of ash as well running through here. Beige Blonde, Champagne Blondes, Platinum Blondes, all kinds of blondes running through here. It has an ash brown root. Make sure you see that. Just really, really beautiful. So I'm going to give them to you side by side so you can get a look at these two beautiful shades. Okay, let's try it on. Okay, let's give it a shake. Like I said, I have not tried this on till now. Let's see how it fits. A little large. I would need to take this in just a little bit. Okay, let's see. Wow, there's been a lot of buzz about this wig. Beautiful bob. I can see why this is nice. Let me fix my ear tabs a little bit. Now, you might need to steam this off your face. It looks like it might want to fall. Even though I would not probably steam it too much, I think this is the look that they're trying to get here. Just a side sweep here. On this, as you see, it has a nice length here. Now, my face is nine inches from hairline to chin. This bang is 5.0, 5.50 to six. So it is layered. You can see that. Comes down to about six inches. Again, my face is seven, uh, nine inches from hairline to chin. The sides are 11. The back is 10, has a three inch nape. So it has an overall length of 3 to 11. Like I said, I'd have to take this in a little. I find it a little large, super low density. I want to show you the inside of the cap. Again, here's Cream Soda Blonde. Let's look at the inside of the cap. All right. It has a lace front, a mono part, as you can see, closed ear tabs with stays, open wefted, pull adjusters, and a non-extended nape. And there is a little stretch here. So that's the inside of the cap. Really pretty. Very well done. Again, just giving you a side-by-side -side of these colors, so pretty. Okay, let's see. I might spray this just a little, just to deal with some of the flyaways. There is some flyaways here. I want to show you how this looks in the front. 
you can get a look at this lace front. Always well done, uh, the lace fronts at Beltress. It runs to right here. Coverage, there's my bow here. Barely see it there. And really undetectable here. So good coverage. I have a 21 and a quarter inch head circumference. And this is a nice style, popular style. I think this will be very popular. These bobs are just so on trend right now. And a bob never goes out of style. You can wear this forever. It's always going to be in style. And this is very layered. As you can see how it tapers around on the front. It's a little thinner on the bottom. It's not a one length bob. It's not like that. It is layered like we talked about with the specs. So you're going to have a lot of movement here with these fibers. It is, these are heat friendly fibers. So of course you could add a little curl to this if you'd like. Make it super straight. You could run a flat iron through this and make it even more straight than it is if you like that look. Um, there is really no permatease here. This is a very, very sleek, sleek style. All right, I will also insert some pictures, some video footage uh, and outdoor lighting of both of these shades so you'll get a look at them. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Again, please like and subscribe to my channel, and I will see you next time.